Okay, quick update on the Blazer 125cc HS. As you can see, it's in a partial dis disassembled state, both sides, primarily for cleaning. Also on the left side here, I did want to check the output shaft, make sure there was no excessive play, make sure everything seemed to be okay. And it does. The next step on the right side will be to drain the oil, remove the exhaust, and remove that side cover to get ready to remove the clutch. I'll be draining the oil into a clean container just to check for any uh, particulates from the clutch. Since the oil that's in here is not very old, since this clutch was just recently replaced. Um, so this will be the third clutch technically going in, so it's been replaced twice. Uh, they replaced it approximately six months ago, but the bike was never really ridden. Um, he rode it once after getting it back, and it died. Uh, he took a jump, and it quit. So he uh, now, six months later, I have it to replace the clutch yet again. So this will be the third clutch going in, but technically replaced twice. Um, Anyways, with the side here, I did run into some problems. The bolts here, pretty much all of them were stripped out. One had to be drilled out. The other one actually did come out, but it was stripped. And the other two, we had to get pretty creative to remove them. But I'll probably steal two from the left and just put two on each side. The owner will be fine with that. So, anyways, that's where we're at right now on this bike. Also, I thought I'd mention the kid who owns this bike he is currently four he'll be turning five in two weeks hence why this bike needs to get done sooner rather than later that's why i'm working on it right now he's been riding four wheelers since he was two uh they have some big adult size four wheelers on the property if he can and find hat and he has the keys he'll ride them uh he would actually drive the truck around if he had the chance so don't worry, he is fully capable of riding this four-wheeler. If you were to look at, look at him, he looks more closer to a seven-year-old than a senior kindergarten. So he's fully capable of riding this bike. Don't worry about his safety. He's been riding these bikes for a long time. So even though this bike says 10 and up, he does perfectly fine. If he could ride at school and back every day, he would and he could probably ride it there better and safer than most people driving a car. So, anyways, just wanted to clarify that. I know some of the Karens out there in the world, if any watch my videos, would definitely be uh, not liking that, but it is what it is. I'm not telling you where I am, I'm not telling you where he lives, and his parents let him ride it around on their property. All will be supervised, so he's fine. So anyways, like I said, next step, drain the oil, get it taken apart, and we will proceed. I have found a clutch on Amazon, but I'm still looking around for a potentially better quality clutch to put in here. So hopefully this problem won't happen again. Also, I just got to double check that it is a 13 tooth clutch, but from all the research I've done, that's what it should be. So there we go. I will talk to him later. Please keep it redneck like always, and uh, please subscribe and comment.